Hey, what is up, everybody? It's Damron. I'm playing Elder Scrolls Online. We're in the High Owl expansion. Specifically, we've been playing the Tales of Tribute new card game. It's super fun. If you haven't checked it out, in this video, I'm going to show you the location of the Knight Commander Clue, which is going to upgrade one of your cards in your St. Palin deck. So let's go ahead and look at the clue itself. If we open it up, it says we need to go to High Isle, where Knights Joust and Clash, and alongside a Grand Arch with bills carefully laid, is where you'll find this clue. So obviously, we need to go to High Isle and Ammon which is the new section but before we do that let's go ahead and check out the card that we're going to be upgrading again this is in the saint palin deck and we're going to be up, uh, upgrading banneret which is an agent card that has three uh, power when you play it but also it has taunt with five health so this is a good card to absorb power from your opponents and we're going to make it even better one of the better upgrades in the game so we need to go to high isle and aminos you can see we're on the high isle portion on the west side near port navir actually um, in the castle navir section there's actually a jousting arena and this is actually where i am so go right where i was on the map and you'll see this is the arch that it's referring to in the clue and if you go under that arch you'll be in the jousting arena which is cool but on the left side of this you will find your treasure tribute box right here next to this ladder as always, it will automatically upgrade your card to the upgraded version. You don't have to do anything else and it will consume the clue. So let's take a look at the upgraded version of the card. So now, uh, same cost, right? You're also gonna get the three power, but whenever you play a St. Palin card, you're gonna restore two health. Now it can't go above five, but this is really powerful to have a five power agent on the board that you can heal. So hope you guys found this helpful as always, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video.